This is the Sony Ericsson CK13i, uh, I believe. Yep. <laughs> I got this in my uh, one of my last phone hunt, and uh, well, the phone looks horrible, mostly because it has that um, gluey paint over it. Not to mention the back how it looks. But as damages, it only has this uh, chipped part here. But other than that, maybe the chrome somewhere. Maybe it has some scratches, but that's kind of it. And the screen has a protective uh, foil, or what to call it, screen over it. The phone works fine. So it's a shame not to give it a proper cleanup, you know? So let's begin. Smooth animation. So, I got a, I bought a battery for it, not original, but wait, what? <laughs> it's starting to get swollen already. When I press it here, it goes. Anyway, SIM card. And to take it apart, so torque screws, baby. Oh no, the chrome part it's uh, in one piece with the back side, so I'm guessing this is where, yeah, this is where you have to open it up. <laughs> okay, that was simple. I hope I didn't speak too soon, spoke too soon, however. Okay, here are the buttons, mm. the earpiece, can I take it out without damaging it, please? Hmm. Okay, I think I can, yes, thank God. Okay, so this is the front piece. Ah, the display. Wonderful. Okay. There we go. They are out in one piece. To push this back without snapping it. Okay. Now for the bottom antenna. Here it is, and here, there we go, antenna, and what that's left is the loudspeaker, which came out nicely, oh yeah, this is still pretty good, this is one loudspeaker, literally, this in the vibration rotor, here it is, motor, so one piece with this, yeah, let me take the display out, so here are the two clamps here and here that hold it in place. Just push this by hand. Okay, the screen is very clean. Well, I just need to blow some air over it and that's it. Here's the main board. Hmm. All right, time to get cleaning. And honestly, it's not too much to clean on the insides, but I'll just give it a classic brush. <laughs> hmm. This wasn't even used too much. I'm guessing maybe who had had the phone got bored of it easily. Yes. <laughs> mm, and the buttons, eh, just give it something. Easy because I need to do some polishing here in the middle button and that uh, is gonna take some time. So 
maybe maybe it's just dirty. I hope maybe it's just dirty and doesn't need polishing, but I don't know what to say. Nah. Nah. This is clearly some scratch. It was scratched here somewhere. While in during transportation or something. I'll polish this, then I'll properly clean it because it's gonna get dirty with polish anyway, so. Now this, this is gonna be tricky, tricky. Hmm. Still a bit uh, sticky. I'll uh, also use some alcohol, but since this still has some juice on it, in it, why not use it to the maximum? Oh my god! And some alcohol for plastic parts. Let's see what happens. Actually, I'm gonna start with this since it dried up. Okay, what's that? The best way to see if this is clean or not, to use a lamp. Let's see. Something like this. Well, not look straight in the light like this. Look at from this angle. And you can see in the reflections if there are any dirty parts. See like that. Okay, it's clean. Well, would you look at this? Well, the the paint is still there, but only the glue, the sticky side, comes off. You know. Yeah, it has its fair share of hits in the back, but yeah. Okay, that sounded weird, but I'm I'm gonna stop talking. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna give it some silicone. Put some on this. See what happens. Yeah, it smells nice. I wonder if it will react to the plastic. I hope not. <laughs> I need to absorb the rest. Well, it gave it a shine. It feels slippery now. But... Uh, yeah, giving it, shine it, uh, well, making it shiny, mm, kind of makes you a bit ignore the hits and scratches, but let me try on this side, see what happens. So 
looks a bit so so but still it's uh, it's better yeah leave this here now it's time to polish some parts what i'm mostly interested in mostly the buttons a bit too much And I put a bit here again. Okay, I said a bit, not much. It has a small hit there, but not too much. Hey, it is uh, better. Actually, it quite is a bit better. Now here. Well, I think the this button looks better, right, compared to how it was. <laughs> now the hard part, cleaning. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Now this. To be careful with this so it doesn't snap from the rubber or whatever is this called the frame the well rubber frame anyway actually you know what i can actually oh it's inside i can clean this with water i'll go to the sink and be right back clean that some water on it but that should be removable easy let's look at it again after i dried it and there are some fine scratches here, you can barely see them, but it's better than before, right? Now, time to put it back together. And I still have to use... Uh, get back in here, you. There we go. I haven't uh, cleaned the screen. This needs to go like this and push it down here right right where it was right here <laughs> yeah nothing much on this These volume buttons are sensitive. All right. So, SIM card check. Battery check. Battery cover. Check it. Check check. <laughs> One last honest cleanup, and here's the finished phone. Yeah, it's the best I could do. I don't have a body shell for this phone, but it looks nice. <laughs> Let's turn it on. Should I take the screen protection off? Hmm. The curiosity, I hope this is a screen protection over it, right? Okay, this is one sturdy screen protection. Okay, if I press hard on it, see it, it will come off, but I'm gonna leave it here since this is rare next to impossible to find nowadays, so. Nice. It's pretty smooth, <laughs> camera. Hmm. 
and no more uh, music DJ and stuff like that. Yeah, so this is my cleanup video of the Sony Ericsson CK 30i. Thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed it, please leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. And I wish you a very awesome day, just like yourself, and all the best. Bye.